let's talk about what a ghost winery is. You may have heard the term about a ghost winery. Obviously, we have ghost stories, but I thought it would be fun to tell you a little bit of a ghost story that is real. But when we refer to a ghost winery, when we're talking about the wine industry, this is a term that we use to describe wineries out of California. And they were built between 1860 and the 1900s and then were abandoned and fell into disrepair and basically just left to the elements. So they look a little spooky. They have broken down and they were abandoned due to the Great Depression. We had prohibition. We had a vine disease. We still have it. But before they knew how to work with it called phylloxera that basically eats vines from the ground up. It eats them from the roots. And so they die. So vineyards were starting to experienced damage because of this disease. So before Prohibition, there were over 700 wineries in California, and 14 years later, there were only 40 left. So it gives you an idea. Now, of course, California today, hundreds of wineries there. The industry has come back to life and then some, but a ghost winery. And some of them have been recreated. They have gone into them and they have refurbished them. But a history in regards to the California wine industry that definitely took off with a boom and then got hit with a lot of different events, one on top of the other, that caused a demise of the industry and then it was rebuilt. But a ghost winery does refer to those wineries that were impacted at that time. So that's a fun bit of trivia for you about what a ghost winery is in regards to the California wine industry. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe and follow along as we learn about wine together.